we need the club to talk to us first. Um, there are clubs who think that they ought to go off and report it directly to the insurance company. That just confuses matters um, because obviously you know, the insurance company might be able to track it. They don't have any policy numbers. They don't know who's, who's done what with it. So in the first instance, we want it reported to us. We will put together all the information that the insurers are going to need uh, and get any claims forms completed that they require get any photographs or statements or estimates or anything else and then we will submit it to insurers and discuss it with insurers on behalf of the client. Um, we're there when there are claims to work on behalf of the client to ensure that they get the settlement that they deserve in, as quickly as possible. Um, the other issue that, that we see happening more and more is clubs seem to assume that just because they've hit a cricket ball out of the ground and it's damaged the car that they actually have a liability. Now they may or they may not, <coughs> it depends on the circumstances, there is legal precedent, uh, the case that everyone quotes is Bolton versus Stone, um, and it basically says that if, if a club could foresee that there's an accident and have done nothing to, or have not taken adequate proportions against that, then they clearly are negligent. However, if it's unforeseeable and or they've taken adequate precautions to make sure that it doesn't happen, then they may not be liable. So it's very important not to admit liability and to contact us first so let's know the circumstances so we can discuss it with insurers to establish whether you have a liability or not.